Uh, Kevin Stefanski um, talked about the season for Baker Mayfield hasn't been uh, what Baker Mayfield thought it would be for uh, himself and the team, really. I think for Baker, it's really it's so similar to our team. We, we've we've been inconsistent uh, coaches. We, we've been inconsistent. We just haven't consistently uh, done it at a high level, uh, you know, enough. Um, and that's what happens when you have the record we have and 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 some of the opportunities that we've talked about in the past. So uh, for all of us, we're just searching for that consistency uh, and, and really for. All of us, we have to double down on how we prepare. Uh, I think you guys know Baker. He works very, very hard at this. Uh, he, he grinds uh, him, the quarterback room with him and Case and Nick and AVP, TC McCartney. I mean, those guys spend a lot of time uh, on this and making sure that they're uh, ultra prepared uh, to play. Tim Bielek, um we've talked about this a little bit. Do you think Baker Mayfield is pressing? I, I, I'd love for him to go out, complete a couple passes, and start having a little bit of fun at the quarterback position. Yeah, I, I, I wrote about that on Tuesday for our Football Insider newsletter. I think he's pressing, and you bring up a good point, then maybe he's not having as much fun as he normally has. I mean, we know his sense of humor. We see it in the progressive commercials that you see uh, a few times a week out there that he's got a sense of humor. He's a guy that, you know, plays off emotion and there's good and bad to it. When it, when it's good and he's riding high, you can see this, the confidence is sky high, but Saturday, I really saw a lot of pressing. And I think, you know, that there's so many factors that go into that, the poor play, the injuries, you know, we know he's he can hear that he hears the noise even if he's better now at tuning it out than maybe he was you know early in his NFL career he still can hear it because that's just kind of how it is and he has there's all sorts of pressure for him to need to be good and I you can see that out there and especially I think where it shows up the most is in the two minute drill I mean you look at the numbers of what he's done in the fourth quarter he's been statistic he's been one of the worst fourth quarter quarterbacks in the NFL and I think that comes from pressing too much and feeling like he needs to do too much instead of just doing the simple thing get the ball out get it to guys and let them do their thing instead of feeling like he needs to force something like he needs to be the hero in these situations just find just be the distributor that he knows how to be and i think that's that's all that he really needs to do i mean we've seen him do it before i mean he's had some fourth quarter comebacks in his career he just needs to find a way to settle down and relax in those moments because I've always, I always think back to the one story of the Super Bowl when the 49ers played in Joe Montana. I think it was against the Bengals when he said he was in the huddle asking the guys, like, hey, is that John Candy over there? And the calm and the poise that he has in there, I think that's where Baker just kind of needs to find a way to, to be, is to just be calm in those situations and just keep things simple. If he does that in those situations, I think he can be fine. 